What's up, everyone? So today I'm very happy because we're finally working again on the Vitassi rocket. <laughs> and if this is your first time here, my name is Jose Rodriguez. And what we're gonna be to uh, <laughs> sorry, what we're gonna do today, we're gonna get rid of all this stuff that is underneath the bike, which is you know the engine mounts, which I think they're look pretty ugly i think i can make it look better also i'm gonna get rid of this spring that is under the seat because i don't know it doesn't look bad but i don't like it at all because one thing i want to do with this bike once i you know put the big four kit the 180 cc i want to uh put the muffler right here that sells like the honda cbr uh 600 double r which it looks pretty cool and I think it will make this bike look nicer but you know what uh let's let's just go to work
So guys, uh, this is how the scooter looks right now <laughs> and I'm not gonna lie, it looks pretty bad honestly it's only half of the scooter and you know the reason I decided to um, like take this part off or the back was because uh, I want to stretch the bike a little bit, I want to put the seat a little bit lower because I think you know whenever you get on the bike it's like the seat is kind of high so whenever you're riding it it kind of hurts you I mean I don't know if you can see like like right here you're you're like this because you know the seat is kind of like pushing you towards the tank and when you ride it it's a little bit uncomfortable uh, you know after 30 40 minutes so I want to put the seat you know let me grab this so I just want to uh, for example it was something like this right as you can see the angle is pretty steep or it's pretty incline or whatever you want to call it I, I don't know how to say that word so what I want to do is stretch it a little bit to the back and down something like this it's not gonna be too much it's only gonna be like two or three inches but before it was this is where it was before and yeah uh, you know I just uh, going to stop right here because I need to go back to the drawing board and I need to figure out some things that I'm uh, you know wondering how am I gonna do it because I know once I put the tank back, the angle of the tank with the seat. So I have it right here. So this is the tank right of the bike. And I just broke a freaking little tap. Sorry. <laughs> I broke this right here. Man, I'm gonna have to put it back. Well. So this is the tank and this is the seat. So the way the bike was, the angle was perfect, you know. So if I lower down the seat, there's going to be like an opening between. And if I lower it down and stretch it, there is going to be like a gap in between the seat and the gas tank cover. But what I was thinking is about, a, you know, fiber lasting this part and you know grab uh, some molding clay and make this a little bit longer so that way the this thing can you know look like it belongs there so there is going to be a lot of work into this build but man i don't have anything to do and this is for fun so I think I'm talking too much. I don't want to take any more of your time, guys. Thank you so much for watching. And if this was your first time uh, watching my channel, uh, please subscribe. There is more coming. And I have a bunch of tutorials, you know. I'm going to show you how to paint your bike, you know. Some, some tricks. I have some tricks under the sleeve that I want to show you. But this is going to be um, future videos. So thank you so much for watching. 
uh, <laughs> I don't know what else to say, but I'll see you in the next one. Bye.